if you spend some time on freezer burns, then you might stave off the stomach churns. Rake's the frozen food master. He's best bud to your taste buds. Hi, welcome to Freezer Burns. I'm your host, Greg, the frozen food master. And you're joining me as I eat my way through the freezer aisle, one box at a time today. I'm reviewing this, brand new from Red Robin, Red Robin Seasoned Steak Fries. Now, we've done a number of restaurant-inspired frozen French fry reviews here on Freezer Burns, right? We've done Burger King, we've done Arby's, we've done Checkers, uh, what else did we do? Uh, we did a Texas Pete, uh, a sweet potato fry. Anyway, what do those have in common that this does not? Well, what, what they have in common is that I actually like the fries in the restaurant. Now, I understand that people love Red Robin steak fries, and, and I like Red Robin as, as a restaurant. But I'm not a fan of steak fries in general, and I'm certainly not a fan of steak fries from Red Robin. What I am a fan of, from Red Robin's standpoint, is that the steak fries are unlimited, and I love the seasoning on the steak fries. You can kind of hear I got the oven uh, kind of preheating to 425 degrees. I'm going to get this out of the bag. I'm going to get it in the oven, and when I come back, I'll tell you how it looks, how it smells, and I'm going to decide, is it better? In, uh, from the freezer aisle from Red Robin Season Steak Fries than it is at the Red Robin restaurant or is it just the same? You gotta take that with a grain of salt. Regardless, I'm gonna get this out of the oven. I'm gonna get it down deep into my belly. Okay, I've taken these Red Robin Season Steak Fries out of the oven. I baked them at 425 degrees Fahrenheit for 30 minutes. Here's how it looks. As you can see, it looks like seasoned steak fries, guys. It looks just like the ones you get at, at Red Robin. I wouldn't be shocked if it's the exact same ones that they distribute to the Red Robin store, um, we'll see how it tastes. Now, I remember in the beginning of the segment, I said how much I don't like seasoned steak fries. It's not that I don't like the seasoned part, it's that I don't like the steak fry part. And while I like fries, the reason why I don't like steak fries is because it's like so dry. It's like baked potato wedges. You gotta have a nice crisp to the skin, or a nice seasoning on the outside or like super burnt on one side for it to be like fun for me. That's just a personal thing. My wife likes steak fries. My kids like steak fries. I don't like steak fries. I'm sure you may like steak fries or maybe you're with me and you hate steak fries. Anyway, regardless is when I give this review, keep that, take that with a grain of salt. Is that I'm gonna to try to review these based on how accurate they are to an actual Red Robins seasoned steak fry, uh, but I'm not gonna like it in the grand scheme of fry products. I just won't, sorry, don't. These vary in size coming out of the bag. They vary in size. They maintain their variance in size coming out of the oven, just like Red Robin. There's um, a decent amount of season seasoning. It's not anything where you're like, oh my God, way too much seasoning, or whoa, where's the seasoning? Let's see how it tastes. Needs more seasoning. That's how it tastes. What I will say though, I was worried because there was no deep fry instructions on the bag. That's weird for fries out of the freezer aisle. Even though only a small subset of people have deep fryers, they always say deep fryer. Why? Because it's way better than the deep fryer, always. This one just had oven directions and I was like, whoa, just oven directions? It's gonna be like, mushy or dense or not crispy enough. I gotta say, these are pretty crispy on the outside. Like crispy without needing to put it on foil like, like the Checkers uh, french fries. But, not enough seasoning. Not enough seasoning, not even the same amount of seasoning as you have at the Red Robin restaurants. And the benefit of the Red Robin restaurants is, ladies and gentlemen, because you have a whole seasoning jar right on your um, on your table that you can extra season. So if you like Red Robin steak fries, I highly recommend. You know, if you like, if you're like so invested in the Red Robin cut of steak fry, 
go buy these, but then also go to your Red Robin restaurant, get the extra thing of st steak fry seasoning to add on top of this because this doesn't even have the same amount of seasoning as the ones they give you at the restaurant. Does that make sense? Okay. Red Robin seasoned steak fries, brand new in the freezer aisle. It is a decent product, don't get me wrong. And remember, take this with a grain of salt because I don't like steak fries, but I give this a four out of five star rating. What would be awesome? They have a nice little extra seasoning packet. That would be pretty awesome. Just like when I said with Arby's, they just included the Arby's sauce, man, that would be perfect. This, I give a four out of five star rating. Question of the day, what is your favorite burger at Red Robin? For me, it's gotta be the Royal because I love the fried egg on top of a burger. Remember we talked about this, breakfast food for dinner? As always, I'm your host, Greg, the Frozen Food Master. This has been another review of Freezer Burns. Thanks for watching. See you next time.